One common error men make when trying to enhance their appeal to women is viewing attractiveness through a male-centric lens rather than understanding the female perspective. This got me pondering, how can women be drawn to both rugged, muscular men and the members of BTS? And why do we often see stunning women with seemingly average-looking men? Here's what I discovered. Women's attractions are incredibly diverse. And the biggest mistake we make is trying to reduce it to a simple formula. In this video, we'll explore the contrast between what men think women want and what women actually find appealing. Part 1. The Female Perspective At its essence, the female gaze is narrative-driven. There's a reason why romance novels top bestseller lists and why women are the primary audience. Similarly, artists and musicians have historically been adored by women for their storytelling through creativity. Every time you step out, you're telling a story through your appearance, hairstyle, walk and body language. Women are attuned to these subtle cues. Part 2. The Role of Physical Appearance While physical looks do play a role, women's preferences vary widely. Traits like a chiseled jawline, slight facial hair, height, a lean physique, and a mix of masculine and feminine features are often admired. If you were to design a universally attractive man, he might resemble Brad Pitt or Michelle Moroney from 365 Days. However, preferences differ greatly and women are not limited to one type. Just as men have varied tastes, so do women. Part 3. Beyond the Surface Discovering that women desire tall, wealthy and fit men can sometimes lead to insecurity among men. But if you observe couples in any busy area, you'll notice a mix of average and beautiful pairings. This is because women don't view male attractiveness solely through a physical lens. Men often focus on physical improvements, but women consider humor, voice, charisma, and other traits just as important. Part four, dynamic attraction. Physical attraction can grow over time as women get to know a man better. Many men fall into the he's all right category initially, but as women learn more about them, their attractiveness can increase significantly. This is different from men who often experience instant attraction. Part 5. Relative versus absolute preferences. Height, income and status are often mentioned as attractive traits. However, these are relative preferences. Women generally want a man who is taller than them, earns slightly more and has a bit more status. Most couples share these relative differences and exaggerating these traits can lead to unrealistic expectations. Part 6. Finding your niche. Instead of trying to appeal to everyone, focus on your niche. If you're into fitness, you'll likely attract women who share that passion. People tend to pair up with those who have similar interests and backgrounds. Part 7. The myth of the nice guy. Women often dislike nice guys because they can come across as weak and desperate. Women prefer men who are confident, assertive, and set boundaries. These traits are often associated with the so-called bad boys, who are not necessarily criminals, but exhibit confidence and self-respect. Many men define their self-worth by their ability to attract women, often trying to meet impossible standards. This video aims to provide a clearer picture of what women truly seek through the female perspective. Thanks for watching.